afternoon, good afternoon, good morning, wherever you are in the world, good evening. <laughs> I'm Johnny Domino, I'm your host today, and this is another Getaway Special interview. Hello, Johnny. How you doing? Oh, we're going to get straight to it, ma'am. Yeah, come on, let's dive right on in. Yeah, y'all let's, should, let, let's let the people know what we're here for. Y'all should know Jessica Potts. Y'all don't know Jessica Potts? I am known by some. Yes. As? Louisiana Cannabis. Louisiana Cannabis. They ought to tell y'all where we going today. Yes. <laughs> and, and you know what? Uh, the last name Potts. The real last name. <laughs> yes. Now, you got a special with Los that I recorded. Mm-hmm. So I got to see before. Y'all got to see this coming out uh, not too long from now. But uh, this is a little bit. I, I heard about your story and, and that the Potts thing didn't come with a, a, a family of weed people. Uh-huh. Weed smokers or weed growers or nothing like that. But coincidentally, you end up needing medical marijuana. You know, and I don't want to break the interview and tell them too much because we're here yes. to talk about this event. Yes. Yeah, yes. so it's some background behind Louisiana Cannabis, and I think, I really believe it. And uh-huh. I, know, matter of fact, I know she earned that name, that <laughs> <Yes>. title. <laughs> uh, and, and as I am for all medicinal and mainly, mostly all the time, I want my recreational time, mm-hmm. you know, for mental health. But you needed the medical part. Yes. I uh, was diagnosed with MS. I have had to learn how to walk seven times in my life. Mm. I've had to have a hip replacement. I was three years in pain management mm. with fentanyl, morphine, six to eight Percocets per day. Mm. Um, and now I only use medical cannabis. And I'm not on any chemo. I'm not on any pain medicine. Wow. Um, I my MS is in remission. <laughs> I, this that, is you the mean I've been. you mean to tell me this big black, bad old plant, this old illegal plant? Because they say it's legal, but I still pe- see people going to jail for, for having weed. It, it aggravates me, you know. Yeah, but it, I don't want to get too much into yeah, that, I'm right? Like, do, so do that right? <laughs> nah, don't we, we ain't gonna start that right now, y'all. Because we got something special for y'all. So check this out. We heard what it done for her, and I know you trust what it does for me. I'm, I'm jolly, happy, hungry, whatever. But you got an event coming up that I am got my VIP passes when she told me about it. Yes. Yeah, like. So it is my brainchild, Happy Halloween. <laughs> um, creative. Yes, mm-hmm. at Red Stick Social. Beautiful venue. Yes, the fourth and fifth Floors. Um, the whole fourth and fifth? Yes. No, that's the good flows. Yes. Lowe's, Lowe's, you know, we worked over there. Yeah, yes. it's beautiful. And so you have the rooftop terrace where um, medicinal cannabis consumption okay. will be permitted. Um, we have vendors, we have a DJ. We'll so we can, sm- we can smoke up there? Yes. Boom. I've never been to one of those. Let me ask you Not a question. Not here. Not here. Let me ask you, I have a question for go you. Go ahead, go ahead. When you go out to eat, you go somewhere nice. Do you get do you get a what's your favorite drink? Water. <laughs> okay. Besides water. Like, like alcoholic? Yeah. Um, I like drinking it depends. I'm I'm more of a Tito's and Sprite man. Okay. Something like that, but me and alcohol don't get along well. Okay. When's the first time that you saw somebody drink alcohol? Early on as a child. Really? Yeah. Okay. I had alcoholism within my parenting, but within the house, yeah. How many people do you think die or get injured because of alcohol a year? Uh, millions. Okay. So I just bring this up because I know there's a stigma. hmm It's not a fair stigma. Not at all. Um, In regards to cannabis. And it it is up to us to stop whispering to you smoke. Do right. You have any on you? <laughs> like, yeah. Let's stop that because we are in a medically legal state. It's for any chronic or debilitating condition. Hmm. Um, and that's facts, cramps. right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Menstrual cramps. We'll have a doctor. We'll have doctors there that can help you at the you, event. At the event to get you certified. Okay. So that you are happy, healthy, and legal. 
Right, right. And so we're going to have a great time. It's going to be a con. Uh, the, the theme is Alice in Underland. Um, <laughs> I like it. Y'all Underland. Can, yes, y'all wait till you see my outfit. Um, I'm coming in something messy. Really? Oh, I got it. I cannot do regular. Um, I'm either going to be a, the laughing stock of the party, that dude crazy. I can't believe you did that. I can or, see you as the caterpillar. I'm, I'm do something. I'm, I might, I might do something else. You never know. Okay. I might, I might, I'm, I, I don't know. Now I've heard there's a lot of people coming as mushrooms. <laughs> so, uh, you know, will shrooms be available too? <laughs> you know, <laughs> when will we get there? <laughs> you will get. Listen, it's fabulous. You're gonna have free bowling. Oh, food. free bowling! Yes, cool. food. Mm -hmm. Um, a live DJ. Cool. Um, the doctors will be there signing people up for their recommendation. The pharmacy will be there. What? Um, Filling scripts on set. They are going to be giving discounts mm. for that night. Um, so make sure you're there. Of course, we're going to have beautiful ambiance and a VIP high tea starts at six. Now, what's that? What's that? A, a VIP high tea? Well... A high tea is going to be on the terrace, mm -hmm. and we have it decorated, and we'll have many different infused teas cool. and drinks. That come with my VIP pass I bought? That does. Ooh. I'm, and I ain't going to lie. I've never been to a party on time. I will be there for my early benefits. Tell me yes, tell me about the 6 o'clock thing. Yes. Because I'm going to be there at 5.59. Yes. So you can get... <laughs> So you can make sure that you get your tea. Mm -hmm. You will be able to self um, self dose yourself about how much concentrate you would like in your tea. It's an educational experience as well. Oh, that's that's dope. You said that. So yes. I like that educational part, y'all, because a lot of people. I think some of our state reps and our council members and some of these old folks that run this place. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but most of you are for way over forty, over fifty. Pushing sixty. Listen, y'all should come and just do the educational part. Don't drink no tea. Don't don't take nothing. Bring uh -huh. your, your your church peppermints and come learn because you told me it was an educational thing in there uh, component in there too, right? Yes. Tell me about that. So, um, I let everyone know my story, and I also briefly touch on the medical benefits of cannabis, especially for our population, mm -hmm. for our elderly. Um, and for black people and white people mm -hmm. and all people in between here in this state, we have the highest, one of the highest mortality rates mm -hmm. here. Um, Facts. So this is a really good thing that can really help people get off a lot of prescription medicines and improve your life. And mm, facts. Really, I want to create a sense of community because people sit around and like they'll smoke in isolation or their little silos. Mm -hmm. And cannabis can really and is really used as a connection point for people as well. Oh yeah, it's a social. Uh, yeah. it's a it's a so, social a healthy, medicine. A healthy yeah. social one. You made me think about it. I I I hate to admit it. I, Xanax really helped me at one time, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. My medicinal got me off of Xanax. You know, yes, and it's like, <laughs> yeah. So I mean, and I'm I'm open about my mental health stuff. Like I I've been taking it seriously now because I came from a family who be like, no, don't let them put the crazy on you. They put it on all us. <laughs> That's how my family you was. They, they were trying to hide crazy. Like, nah, let me go get my checks and medicine, man. I probably wouldn't even have to be doing this if I got my check, man. You know what I'm saying? My mama missed out on a check like that. But nah, <laughs> I got issues, but I'm working on them. But no, I, I like that. I think that people who don't do it should come check out the atmosphere and vibe. Yes. Instead of being judgmental and closed-minded, if, if somebody wanted to just come and not participate, mm -hmm. is there a, a ticket? For that, like a uh, admission yes, and entry type yes, thing. Yes, general admission is mm -hmm. twenty five dollars. So, and that's just the uh, bottom floor. That's it. Also includes the bowling, mm -hmm. um, and the medical sign up and the dispensary and all education. Yeah, and I ain't speaking for none of uh, my friends, but um, I'm trying everything that they have, and I hope <laughs> I float away from there. <laughs> You're going down the rabbit hole. I am going down yeah, the rabbit hole. You are. Yeah, uh, it's my turn. Uh, yes. Los, Los said I'm I'm weak. I got baby lungs. Oh. 
Oh dear. <laughs> they what? call they call me baby lungs. <laughs> well listen, listen, the high tea should help you lubricate all of that so you can really, you know, display a larger lung capacity. Oh crap, I need lung lubrication. Yes. Okay. <laughs> yes. Do that. Do that. Do some breathing exercise. It's going to be great. Hey, I'm going to have a blast. And tell me more about all right, when, where, how to get in touch. Like, tell me that part. Cause, and then I think I got everything. So, can I, I could bring my own smoke if, if I got it from the um, my dispensary your, smoke. You can bring your medical. I yes. can bring gauze? Yes. I can bring gauze. I can bring a pipe. Yes. We'll, um, we'll have a vendor there who. Uh, We'll be giving some things away and also selling a different, you know, cool. types of pipes, bongs, things like that. So I got vendors, so I need a little cash to mm-hmm. on demand, stuff yeah. like that. And also, you know, to uh, if you don't have your medical card, to go ahead and sign up and get it that day. Um, so have they have it tiered, so you can get it for a month all the way up to two years. Mm. So um, it kind of fits everybody's price budget. Mm-hmm. So bring you a little bit for that. We mm-hmm. got you food. We got you for food. Now, if you want to buy alcoholic beverages, bring you some for the bar. Yeah, because we're yeah. not we're not doing all of that, you know. Well, I'm not there for that. Yes, <laughs> I don't know if unless you got a, a, a Halloween bar. Yes. <laughs> Listen, I, look. I hope I hope in the next couple of years we like can really really. Do stuff like that, and people we will. Aren't, We're not gonna hold. Aren't afraid. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna get Big Mama and them in there one day. Big Mama, you gotta come try this. I'm man. listen. Does she have diabetes? I bet she do. Does she have high blood pressure? My community does. Okay. Does she have heart disease? And she. I bet she do, and he do because of my community. How we eat. Okay. Dialysis. Hmm. Okay. Anxiety. PTSD. Hmm. Depression. Hmm. ADHD. Come on now. Look, they all in the back name yes. and stuff that it would help with. And guess what? Er- everybody in here happy. <laughs> and you know what? It and does help better. though. Yeah. And you feel better. Yeah. And you don't deal with the side effects. Yeah. And everybody think that it's, it's all slump, but I know endocrine sativa, like, it's some sativas that'll make me, I will outwork anybody. There's a whole, there's Caffeine. A whole science behind it it's yeah. like once you go down that rabbit hole in mm-hmm. particular that's so what i'm trying to ease everybody down there uh, I, it's like it just opens up everything um it does i'm i'm a, I'm, a, I'm not a expert but i i know a little something yeah i'm i'm distillate and, yeah and it's not isolate just flour it's not just flour and tincture yeah, yeah it's yeah. so much more yeah this it's tinctures mm-hmm. it's uh Breath strips that you can have is candies, yeah. gummies, cookies, yeah, etouffee. And I mean, look at the money Colorado and, and the West Coast made. Like, and did it's time see, to free the money and free the weed. Man. Did you see that uh, they were able to pay all the homeless in Col- in Denver? Using the cannabis money to see if that would help with homelessness. Of yeah. course, it did. Drug dealing always helps with homelessness. <laughs> <laughs> the legal kind. The legal kind. The kind that the United States government sanctions. But yeah, that part she said. <laughs> and now they need to unlock, unlock those gates and let all the black people out there. So that, that's the that real part. drug dealers. Let the professionals do their job. It's legal now. Let them be able to get the licensing. And I want y'all to get involved also on that part, the social justice part, because Mm -hmm. how many people are still getting incarcerated for cannabis? We we are their advocates. Why aren't we saying anything? And are they still and pretending like they're destroying those drugs? Like when you confiscate <laughs> weed now, what do you do? Just bring it on Picardi and resell it, or like we're not well, doing that today? today. <laughs> okay, I can't do that. No, we're not Make doing sure that you today, come <laughs> this Saturday, <laughs> October twenty eighth. That's another show. I got to get Jessica back in yeah. here for the truth. I ain't gonna do that because we too finna have fun this Saturday. <laughs> bring your costume, you know the theme. Bring your stuff, bring your little change if you ain't got your it's license. A fun and guess fun what? Kickback. If you a hater, I'm inviting you because I want you to come see some smooth people as they have fun for Halloween. Thank you, Jessica yes. Potts. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. We we killed it. Tell them how to get in touch in touch oh, with you. Oh, thank you. My but, bad. Well, yeah, because we had just zoomed past that. Yeah. Okay. Follow me on Instagram at Louisiana Full underscore Cannaboss, C A N N A B O S S. Um, all the links to the tickets um, to our Instagram page are on there. 
And I look forward to seeing everybody there. The event will be a be uh, Rested Social mm-hmm. starting at six, ending at twelve. I'm there at six. Okay. Um, <laughs> VIP tickets are forty. General admission is twenty five. Um, everything includes free food and ambiance and different treats. So mm. we look forward to seeing you and having a good educational, safe, legal, fun time. Now look at that Angie. Ain't she just calm and sweet? Don't y'all see how this thing goes? Come and be like that with us this weekend. Sparkle, sparkle, sprinkle, sprinkle. Sprinkle, sprinkle, sprinkle. Not a word in the world. Thank you for coming through getaways and uh check this out. More information is in the caption below. Click the links. It's all in here. It's all in the video. Make sure you come through and tell them, get away, sent you. Thank you.